So it's Adrian reporting for ESCplus.com, and now I have the pleasure to have besides me Katia and Chris. Christian. Yeah? Yes. Christian Roos is the producer of the song that they're going to perform uh, tomorrow. Um, tell us a bit more about it. Tell us a bit more about the rehearsal that we have just seen, guys. Oh, yeah. Um, well, hello. Uh, I'm Katia. And, uh, well, the performance uh, right now, the rehearsal went uh, very good, I think. Uh, I, I enjoyed it, which is the most important thing. And... Um, I, I didn't uh, felt like any fear, which is also good because I'm the newcomer here. So, um, so I think it went well. I hope that I could uh, stay calm uh, tomorrow also and uh, to perform and to enjoy it all because I don't know. Maybe it's the one and only chance I got uh, tomorrow to perform all the people in Estonia. So I will take my I don't know, take my chance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I. Uh I think like definitely there is so much more on Kadi's uh, Kadia's uh, shoulders cuz I can just you know be on backstage or wherever and uh, but uh, mostly yeah, I was just uh, worrying about some technical stuff and uh, today everything was like I, I think like 99% like mm -hmm. everything was fixed so yeah hopefully everything's going to be good tomorrow too Tell us a bit more at how it went in the semifinals in Tartu. You told me recently that you are from Tartu and yeah. you were with your audience there at home. Mm -hmm. So how was it there? Did you expect to go through uh, the semifinals and come here to the finals? Or was it kind of sur a surprise? Or Yeah, well, well, it was, of course, a surprise. But we, ho we really hoped that we uh, could get to the finals. But it was really nice because Tartu, it's our hometown. And uh, it was really like... Uh, Oh, so uh, calm and amazing, and uh, all the family around you supporting you, uh, and uh, I think that um, uh, I don't know. It, it it felt very good, but I think that Sakusurhal maybe is it's right now oh the best feeling I've ever got. Yeah. Everything she said. <laughs> <laughs> uh, recently, also in the press conference, you commented that you have tried to make it to Estelal a few times in the past. Uh, why do you think it didn't go well in the past and did you get here? Well, uh, firstly, I think that um, mm, I was too young, maybe. Uh, and uh, the second time I tried, uh, it was last year. And uh, I was really, really sad uh, because I really thought that the song was the one but right now, I think this song was uh, we, we is the one because uh, that song uh, tells exactly that story that I didn't uh, get through and uh, just uh, you have to believe in yourself and uh, believe that you can sing one day uh, to all of these people. And I think that this song just is, uh, and and that's why I didn't like get in. Uh, on previous years yeah I definitely think that uh, if uh, like the song wrote itself and uh, we wouldn't be here if it uh, wasn't for the last years uh, you know not getting uh, to the semifinals because we wouldn't you know had wouldn't have had the muse or the motive like inspiration for the song so uh, yeah that's crazy how life works out yeah. <laughs> I was actually going to ask you regarding the message of the song how are you uh, thinking of delivering to the people in television are yeah. you gonna do like the same thing again on television brother or is it just stay at the same yeah thing we in the we uh, like they say don't uh, try to fix a thing that already works so like most of the stuff is the same just like some of the like lighting and you know it's a bigger arena we got like more opportunities with like different camera angles and like spider cams and yeah. different stuff so yeah definitely we got like it, it's just like bigger and more like glamorous and, and when it comes to caviar yeah when yeah. In the emotions and everything how do you do that through the message of the song how do you get to to do it on camera Oh, I don't know. I just uh, have to believe in myself <laughs> that I, I can do that and I have to smile and, and open my eyes because I, 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 I don't know, I, I just like to sing uh, like to myself and uh, close my eyes and just uh, sing it to my heart and everything. And But that's not uh, for the big stage. So I have to like uh, si more. sing yeah. and perform to all of you. And this is uh, difficult and to me. And that's the, the, the love from the people help you in order to do this? And, and they're in like in this space or in Tartu because you are receiving a lot of positive comments a lot of positive feedback and a lot of love from both international and mm -hmm. and and Estonian fans so how do you take that yeah I think that uh, when I when I read the comments that say that uh, uh, that you you, you just uh, 
I don't know. I I I I was sad, and then I listened the song, and now I'm 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 I don't know get, getting the help I needed and everything. Yeah. It's it's so amazing, mm-hmm. the, and and when you see those people or you read that them to give you the feedback, it's I don't know. It it just yeah. gives I'm, you. I'm gonna search for one video. I'm gonna uh, show you guys. Uh, it's right. Uh, oh here so uh, like like uh, what you said about like support and you know even that we're in a different city uh, even though uh, we still got like crazy fan support and uh, this is one of the schools that we went to and they later had like some class evening okay. and uh, that's what they did there I'm gonna place the mic here sure <laughs> So yeah, we wow. keep getting you're these really types of feeling videos. it. Yeah, like yeah. some students on the bus, like on a field trip, and they're yeah. singing. And it truly, it, it is truly something that you really um, uh, inspires. Yeah, yes. it's, yeah, it's, yeah. it's yeah. inspirational yeah. in a way. Yeah. So um, regarding to Eurovision, moving on to the Eurovision Song Contest, is it that you followed the contest in previous year? What does it uh, mean to you uh, to have the chance to represent your country in a big well, event? Well, like uh, we are so small country here, so it's it's like very big thing. Yeah, it's crazy because like in the US they compare the uh, Eurovision uh, to the uh, Super Bowl mm-hmm. uh, in the States because uh, yeah it's like if you think like how many like 200 million or I don't know how yeah, many people yeah. are watching that's crazy like you know how many uh, people are in Estonia yep. and then think about how big they were you know like the Europe and everyone who's watching like how big is it crazy mm. so um, you are uh, like um thinking of um, I don't know like in a way that the Eurovision Song Contest is big it's going to be in Israel and everything do you think that there is a formula that uh, could be taken in order in order to to get to win the contest or there is not any formula because we had different kinds of songs winning for the last years and it's how do you really see the contest nowadays oh, that's difficult because yeah uh, in every year there uh, there is uh, a winner like uh, they 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 all are so different and different kind yeah. of good and i think uh of course like uh, you said that uh, you said you've been to uh, to estonia before and uh, like the same thing that uh, uh the tradition it's for estonians it's too you know like uh, whenever the dates are everyone's watching in front of the tv with the whole family and uh if I remember correctly, because I haven't like binge watched uh, all all of the uh, like different seasons, but mm-hmm. uh, if I remember correctly, then last year's uh, last year's uh, yeah, and, and even I mean like globally, uh, like more songs that were like heartfelt mm-hmm. did better because mm-hmm. of course like I remember the big days like uh, Euphoria by yeah. Lorraine yeah, yeah, and yeah, like yeah. those are the party songs, but there have been like uh, some songs that have been laid back and like more relaxed. And uh, just with a message, yep. so yeah, the one from Salvador Sobral yeah, from Portugal. Exactly, that's what. Yeah. I, yeah. So yeah. you never know, actually. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So guys, it was a pleasure talking to you. Uh, wish you the best for the final tomorrow. Um, yes. If you want to introduce yourself again to the uh, send a video message uh, to the regards to our fans on ESUPlus.com, feel free to do it now. You can take the micro as well. Thank you, everyone who is supporting us. Yeah. Thank you guys. That's ah, uh, that's what we're doing it for. And everything, you know, every time you listen to the song, or every time you write a comment, or you even think about the song, that's when we feel grateful. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>